So hey there everyone, I hope you enjoyed that little intro video there. So this is going to be a pretty quick uh, video on YouTube today. I just wanted to let you all know that yesterday my new course on 2D and 3D modeling uh, with drones and Agisoft's Metashape went live. So yesterday was Friday the 21st and here I am recording on Saturday of the 22nd. So I've got some work to do over the weekend. I'm going to be going back out to one construction site and uh, doing some more modeling again and also some video tomorrow. So I figured let's get this up here now and not wait, wait till Monday. So if you pop on over to you to me, um, let's take a look on screen here. So this is the 2D and 3D drone modeling and mapping with Agisoft's Metashape. So what's going into this class? Let's, let's take a look here. So in total, the course is a little over five and a half hours and the course content so introduction to 2d and 3d modeling with drones and then drone photogrammetry uh, is the next section but we have several lectures so first our introduction and then giving into impatience we actually go through a quick model um, using an orbit generated with litchi and a mavic 2 pro and then we've got uh, an explanation of photogrammetry so that's a quick watch and then we talk somewhat about some of the data collection tools out there. So we do a demo with MapPilot. We talk about Pix4D and Drone Deploy. And then I do a whole separate section with Ground Station Pro and MapPilot because those are my two major go-to apps for doing modeling. And then we do a small 3D model with Litchi. And by the way, there are some downloadable resources. So I've actually included images from the models so that you can actually replicate the models. So, and then we move on to the Metashape section. So we spend several sections going through Metashape. Now, what you learn in this course can be applied to other courses or uh, other applications, I, I should say. So the process of doing 3D modeling is similar with a lot of these 3D rendering applications. We're just doing Agisoft's Metashape specifically for this one because it's been working very well for me over the past couple of months. And so this is kind of my go-to modeling program. I also have used Pix4D. Um, I've also used the open web um, modeling software. So there is an open source modeling software out there as well. And um, like I said, we're focusing on Metashape here. But this information can carry over to other applications. So even if you're not a Metashape user, it might be interesting to you. So you might want to check it out. And as we move along, so we've got a closer look at Metashape. We talk about some of the setup of Metashape. And then we talk about some advanced topics, including ground control points. We don't spend a lot of time on ground control points because that's getting into um, some GIS expertise and some expertise beyond the level of this class. But we do get the general basics there. This class is going to be updated and grown over time. As I get feedback from people, I will absolutely be incorporating it if it fits within the class. So if you pop on over and decide to take the class and have questions or comments, feel free to ask them there or here on the YouTube channel as well. Happy to answer them in both locations. All right, it's a Saturday, so I'm gonna be running off in a moment, and um, you probably won't be watching this till the start of the week, but I just thought I'd get it out there. By the way, link is down below in the show notes, and there is actually a discount coupon code for visitors to this channel. So um, I listed this, I think, at 49, um, but for folks in my channel, it's 12.99, so hey, you should be able to get something good out of a five and a half hour course for only $12.99. <laughs> and as always, Udemy does offer um, discounts as well. They do a lot of sales. Uh, if you use the links that I provide here, I get a larger portion of the payment. If you're um, using one of Udemy's discounts, um, that's not one of my coupon codes, they take a bigger share. So just keep that in mind because uh, these videos and these courses help fund this channel. So I really appreciate I appreciate your interest and I appreciate it every time somebody signs up. And by the way, before I even made this announcement, we've already had our first sign up on this course. So I'm looking forward to hearing from that student in the near future. I hope they enjoy it. And I have had this beta tested by several folks. So I got their responses and that's why we went ahead and launched this the other day 
it was ready to go. I hope you enjoy it. And by the way, so one last thing to note, I'm pretty serious in the class and talking a lot about business applications of drone modeling. And I totally left a big part out. And that's just doing this for fun. Creating models with drones, 3D models with drones is really interesting. I love seeing how these things come together. And I love the fact that with Metashape, um, it's not just for drones. It's not all about drones. Um, the folks at Agisoft built their 3D modeling software before drones became the big thing. So people were making 3D models just with their regular digital cameras and Metashape. That is absolutely awesome. And at the end of this course, I do show some links and I show a link to um, another person who did a great tutorial on a 3D model of a fossil or a fossil rock. So there you go. But so it's not all just about doing the work stuff and trying to grow your drone business. Um, building these models is a lot of fun. And if you're just into building the 3D models, um, Agisoft Standard Edition is fantastic and reasonably priced. So that was one of the other reasons why I went with, uh, with Metashape is just because of how reasonable the Standard Edition was for a license where I can continue making some cool models. And we do talk a lot about uh, Metashape Pro as well, but you know, either or you can check it out. But like I said, I totally left the fun part out and I feel kind of stupid about that because this is an enjoyable hobby as well. And it doesn't have to be a business to do this stuff. So if you have interest in 3D modeling with drones, check out the course, links down below, and the coupon code's already built in for you. We'll see you all next week. Have an awesome weekend.